Hey, hello and welcome to this unboxing video. Today we have the Ernie Ball Music Man John Petrucci 7 20th anniversary. We will be unboxing this beautiful instrument. We will go through the specs. We will compare it with the old sister JP6 and we will give some first impression of this fantastic instrument. So, let's get started. Custom Limited Edition 20th Anniversary John Petrucci JP7 Signature Guitar. What a beautiful beast. This is gorgeous. Look at this. Let's get a little closer here. Wow. Look at the top. It's absolutely gorgeous. This special signature is equipped with a lot of unique options, including the Grainfield Mahogany Ball Tongue Design an ebony fretboard with unique gold JP chilled inlays and a combination of a gold and black hardwood. As you can see, absolutely astonishing, beautiful instrument, fantastic, I can't wait to play this guitar, wow, absolutely awesome. Let's take it out of the case and let's go for a closer look. Wow, what a fantastic guitar. Look at that top, look at that color. It's absolutely amazing. I really, really, really like this guitar. I'm very impressed with the quality. The finish is amazing. Absolutely happy with it. And there you go, side by side, the older sister and the new member of the family, JP6 and JP7 20th anniversary, side by side. What a beautiful couple of instruments. It's been 20 years since the first release of the first original JP6 and now Music Man is celebrating the 20th anniversary with this fantastic model. Absolutely amazing. Both guitars, same pickups, same control configurations with a slightly difference between the old one and the new one. Well, talking about the pickups, the Marcy liquefier in the neck, crunch lab in the bridge, toggle switch on the top for PSO and uh, magnetic, where we have at the bottom purely magnetic, in the center a blend between magnetic and PSO, and at the top only the PSO system. For the magnetic ones, three toggle switches, where in the bottom we have here the bridge, in the center a combination of uh, both, and at the, neck, at the top of the neck. Independent magnetic volume here with a push-push 20 dB booster. In the second one we have tone and split coil. And the third one is an independent volume for the PSO system. In the back we can find a beautifully crafted plate with the new JP logo the 20th anniversary distinctive mark and the John Petrucci signature. Gives a very, very nice touch and uniqueness to this fantastic guitar. Another characteristic feature of the JP models is the dual output. As you can see, we have here stereo and mono where in the stereo we can use a stereo cable for independent signal for the PSO and the uh, magnetic pickups so we can have different amplifiers or just record different things from the different outputs. If we compare it with the old version, exactly the same capability. In the back of the headstock, we find the Chalers M6 
tuning machines. Same than the older sister, but now it has the characteristic logo in it. Beyond that, no difference. Let's go for a quick top to bottom comparison. At the left, Jumpy G6. At the right, Jumpy Turkey 20th anniversary. That's the formal model of each guitar. In terms of size, exactly the same dimensions for uh, width, thickness, and length. So no difference there. If we go to the next parameter and we talk about the body wood, the JP7 has a flamed maple top, grain filled Honduran mahogany body, and the JP6 is basswood. Body finish, both high gloss polyester. If we talk about the bridge, exactly the same thing. Custom Jump Petrucci music floating tremolo made of black matte hardened steel in the case of the JP7 with Fitchman uh, power bridges, power bridge piezo saddles. Exactly the same specs in both guitars, with the difference that the JP6 was a beautiful chrome finish. Scale length, both 20, uh, 25 and a half uh, inches. The neck radius, both 15 inches. Same headstock. Frets, 24 frets each guitar. High profile, wide, uh, wide uh, stainless steel, both same specs. Uh, if we talk about the neck wood, the JP7 has a grain field on the room mahogany and the uh, JP6 is a select maple neck. Fingerboard, the JP7 is ebony and the JP6 is standard rosewood. The finish of the neck in the JP7 is a high gloss polyester and in the JP6 is a gunstock oil and hand rubber special wax blend. Sounds very funny and actually it's quite nice. Very comfortable, it's not sticky. I wish the new one had exactly the same finish. Fred markers, the JP7 is a gold JP and a chill inlay. In the JP6 is a standard JP chills. Let's move around and take a look what comes in the case. This is a beautiful black hard shell case. And here we have the classic Music Man envelope with the certificate of authenticity inside. There you go. Certificate of authenticity with the new JP logo that specifies that it's an authentic 20th anniversary edition. Very nice. This guitar was built on April 15, 2021, which is exactly, uh, let's see, a month and five days ago. So it's fresh out of the oven, very new, very, very fresh. In terms of accessory, let's see, what do we have here? Do, do, do. There you go. The typical uh, cleaning slash maintaining uh, set of wipes plus a sticker. The tremolo bar in a beautiful matte black finish. Also a set of springs for different tunings to adjust the tension of the uh, strings. Here we have, two. let's put the guitar back in the case first. Can you see it? Yeah. yeah. So um, here we will find the configuration of the toggle switches, specifying the push-push, cable, etc. Very common in old Music Man guitars. And 
Babe warranty um, form here for the registration and warranty. The key of the case and the battery specification. And there you have it. Perfect. So I think that's pretty much it. Look at this beautiful guitar and this beautiful case with the John Petrucci signature there. It's a beautiful guitar. I can't wait to play it. So if you want to hear how this guitar sounds and how this compare with the older sister, uh, I'll be recording a video probably in the next few days. So stay tuned and see you in the next video. Thank you very much. See you soon.